For 52 years, it has been the Marietta Daily Journal's privilege to present the Citizen of the Year Award to a distinguished and deserving Cobb Countyan. Beginning in 1963 and every year thereafter, we have recognized individuals who have made significant contributions to the quality of life and success that we enjoy in our community. Our 2016 recipient, however, adds even more diversity to an already eclectic group. Never before have we had a citizen of the year who holds the highest judicial position in the state of Georgia. This year's recipient grew up just down the road in Atlanta, the son of an elementary school teacher and a white lily flower salesman. The only child of Edith and Reuben Hines, he attended Grady High School where he lettered in football, basketball, and baseball. He played for legendary coach Irk Russell where he learned the importance of hard work, determination, and perseverance. After graduation, he enrolled in Emory University and told his parents he was going to be the world's greatest doctor. However, after a semester of chemistry, he decided he would become the world's greatest lawyer. He continued his education at Emory for Law School and after graduation in 1968 clerked for a Fulton County judge before joining the Marietta law firm of Edwards, Bentley, Autry and Parker where he later became a partner. Governor Jimmy Carter appointed him to the State Court of Cobb County and he was later elected to the Cobb County Superior Court where he served for 12 years. In 1995 Governor Zell Miller appointed him to the Georgia Supreme Court. For all his professional accomplishments, our honoree is most proud of his family. He has been married to Helen Holmes Hill for almost 50 years, and they have two children, Mary, Margaret, and Hap, and four grandchildren. Earlier this month, this year's recipient was sworn in as the Chief Justice of the Georgia Supreme Court, becoming the first Cobb Countyan to achieve this position. His friends know him as Harris Hines, the rest of the state, however, knows him as Georgia Supreme Court Chief Justice P. Harris Hines. If I could describe Harris Hines in one word, it would be unflappable. It would be honest. That word would be integrity. I'd have to say gentleman. The way that best described Harris is transparent. With Harris Hines, what you see is what you get. He always works to achieve a consensus. And that's what it's all about, is being Chief Justice, is bringing all the people together and keeping all the animals under the tent. Because he's the kind of guy you can put your faith and confidence on that he will do what's right. Harris went to Spring Street School and my grandmother Young taught him in the third grade. Uh, she was what you might say prim and proper, maybe even stern. Had there been any uh, flaws in Harris's character, he would not have gotten out of Ms. Young's third grade class. I met Justice Hines when I was in college at Auburn University. Um, I was student body president and the Marietta Daily Journal did a story about me in the local paper. His wife read the story and told him he needed to get in touch with me. I had said in the article that I was interested in going to law school. So he tracked me down through my, through my mother and called me. I went to lunch with him next time I was in town. Uh, after that he offered me an opportunity to work for him. But that's when we met. We've been going to lunch for 25 years ever since. There are no short stories about Harris Hines. He likes to tell long stories and sometimes it takes him a while to uh, get through them. There was a time when uh, I received some threats against my family. I'd been in the service and I was familiar with protecting my family, but I didn't have a weapon. Harris had a shotgun. He loaned me his shotgun and provided me with shells. Harris never once asked about his shotgun or that it be returned. And I'll remember that as long as I live. Well, I have a few. One that comes to mind right now is that from time to time Harris is called upon to make uh, speeches and talks. Helen, his wife, always admonishes him, Harris, don't try to be funny, because you're not. <laughs> As the presiding justice to Chief Justice Harris Hines, my best advice is to always trust your wingman. 
Keep on being the Harris Hines that you've always been. That's the person we know and love and respect. You'll be a great Chief Justice. Continue to be yourself. I like you the way you are. Well, for a lawyer to give advice to the Chief Justice of the Supreme Court would be somewhat, uh, I think, strange. But, uh, but my advice is don't change one thing. Continue to be the Harris Hines you have always been, unflappable, steady, and to the point. So tonight, let's all rise for the Honorable P. Harris Hines, Chief Justice of the Georgia Supreme Court and the 2016 Cobb County Citizen of the Year. Thank you.